All right, what they have here is the uh, SE3. I, th I hope I pronounced that correctly, SE. Anyways, I got this for Christmas, and now it's, uh, that was December, we're in uh, June now. I'm not doing an unboxing thing here, I've already unboxed it previously. Just want to show off this box first thing. Nice color, nice color box cover here. With their logo. Made in the USA. What's kind of cool here is on the back of the box, they have uh, some survival info here. Determining your uh, distance traveled, topo map information, determining distance across the river, conversions of uh, measurements, distress signals, survival tips. And my phone was dying, so I moved where I can I can plug it in here real quick. And uh, he has survival tips. It's warranty. It's warranty. This warranty is no questions asked warranty on all knives and sheaths. If you break it, send it back and we'll replace it. Warranty is transferable. In other words, we warranty the knife no matter how many times it's been traded. Lifetime warranty. Tag on the end of the box so you can verify what the heck it is if you were to look it up. So anyways, I see it's a nice box. Alright, here we go. I keep moving around because I'm at work. I'm just trying to get a quiet spot to do this. I said I was not going to do an unboxing video, but I have to open a box to get to it, so we're going to do that briefly. So, here's the knife in the sheath. And inside the box comes this card. A decal. I give you two of these uh, survival uh, cards, kind of nice. Some tips, pretty much like what you see in the back of the box. And this is what the, this comes in, wrapped up in this. And it's another decal. And this, I don't remember. Get these out of the way. Here's the knife. Like I said, this was uh, actually this is a Christmas present. I didn't personally buy this, but I'm happy to have received it. Knife itself. And in my opinion, this blade comes really sharp. It's got a really nice edge on it. A little bit, little bit of jumping on top. Scales here are actually a textured uh, G10 uh, material. Right, the blade material is a uh, CPM S35VN. So this uh, blade material is supposed to give it a better uh, edge retention and uh, more uh, more corrosion resistance over the 1095 steel. All right, on to the sheath. It's a uh, pretty decent looking sheath. It's I'm not sure what it's made of. I should know that, but I don't know. It's like it's just a plastic. I don't think it's it's not Kydex for sure. So the belt clip on the back is uh, directional. You can take it off and change it to go this direction. And your belt this way, or your belt this way. And this blade snaps in there pretty tight. It's definitely excellent retention. It ain't coming out unless you pull it. Very excellent retention. There's a lanyard hole, and then you got this piece where you can be hammered on stuff. Maybe you can break glass or pound on something. I'm wondering how well your grip is on this when it's wet, so we'll just find out. I'm going to get it wet and check it out. All right, I took it to the sink and let water run over it. It pretty much just flowed off like it was waterproof. And it's not slippery. I think it's a pretty good, pretty good feel. It's not slick from the water. All right, there you go. In the vertical position. 
no problem. So could I carry this every day? Look at that. No problem. Oh, so that's it. I'm not going to take this out and do a uh, test like chopping wood and all that kind of stuff. There's plenty of videos out there already that can do much better or show that much better than I can possibly do. I'd recommend it. It seems pretty well built. I like the way it feels. I'm sure it's going to hold up really good. Good coating on here for corrosion resistance. Out of the box, scary sharp. Highly recommended. If you feel it's been a beneficial video for you, uh, subscribe and like for more. Alright, take care.